kind of like uh, they get to live, live here free and um, and they help me out around on my farm. My one lives in the house with me. She cooks and cleans and, and takes care of me. And uh, and then the rest they camp. And uh, they took off the first day. And it was like, ah, oh, we're leaving. <laughs> but, you know, I, I know what I'm doing. It's like I know I can handle it. So, And I've been planning this. I've been like putting scenarios in my head. Okay, the fire comes from this way. What would I do? You know, it's like. Yeah. So, so this is my little command center. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> right? I'm filming and editing and talking to people on the phone and everything for <laughs> This is hilarious. <laughs> Isn't it? <laughs> and you know I'm from East LA. Oh really? I was born and raised there. I've How long have you been here? Since nineteen eighty five. Hilarious. Yeah. When I I moved up to Yosemite when I was twenty two. <laughs> yeah, I've gotten some great footage, man. Right now it's all quiet, but it's been like non-stop no, helicopters, no, bombers, just wow. And that was what blew up yesterday. And then the double rainbow video was right here. This is it. This is it. There was a tree. That tree right there. I cut it down since, but that was the one that was in the way. But I had to walk out here to see the whole thing. <laughs> So you can see there's some activity going oh, on there. there. Is there. You can see that yeah, but a little bit. It's going to get real busy again. It's just like, what? it comes in like waves. Oh, oh does it? Yeah. Sure, sure. sure. Oh my god, is this where you shot? Oh, this, 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 this is the command camera. center. I know, right? I got an iPhone, I got an iPhone, I got a computer. I got, my, I, you shoot it with the iPhone? No, are you kidding me? I shoot it with a YouTube game with this camera. Oh, they did? Yeah. I know, after your... How many hits did that... Right now it's at 37, 37 million. Holy and then one of the songs has 33 million. What somebody, song? Who made a song? The Double Rainbow song. Oh, they, they, somebody you took made your voice and sampled it? Yeah, Rainbow there's hundreds song. of songs. Oh my god. Yeah, but yeah, the, the main one has 32 million views. And you on were it. not on anything when you were doing that? No, you look. Said, okay, look. You were having a religious experience. Okay, so you. look, here. Uh, I bought this land in 1988 when I was 25 years old. My children are Yosemite Indians. I've been practicing this Yosemite Indian culture this whole time. Yosemite is a powerful place. And. Look, I'm out here alone. No one knows or cares if I yell at the top of my lungs. And I've been living here for decades. <laughs> right? I make this. I hacked this farm out of that wilderness. See how it looks over there? It looked yeah. like that. I, this is, you know, I'm Noah. <laughs> this is my ark. Got my own well. I got a ton of energy, turn trees. Yeah. Right? Wow. So, so yeah, it was ex versus experience. I saw God. I got a video of God I put on YouTube. That's what the video is. And it was right here. And yesterday, this mountain blew up. Right. What does that mean? I don't want to know while well, we're here. I don't want to know. But... Wait till you see the video that I made right after Double Rainbow. It's called After Double Rainbow. And I talk about uh, how a, uh, a 5.0 or bigger earthquake hits on Santa Ana, during Santa Ana winds in LA. It's going to burn to the ground. That's, so that's kind of been my whole thing. Microsoft commercial, I did a smartwatch commercial, I did a cell phone commercial in New Zealand. Yeah, I was... Good for you! Good for you! Good for you! Absolutely Good for you! That's awesome. That is, that is awesome. Dude, a, a high school in Iceland raised money and brought me out there. And they gave me this festival where they sang and danced and did a play and everything. On the double the rainbow thing? Yeah, yeah. After, after I started going viral. And all that's on my YouTube videos. That is amazing. It's really been really mind blowing the stuff that's out of it, and it just keeps going Isn't that on. Crazy that you can be out here in the middle of nowhere yeah. and put something up like that, and it just it becomes so, a thing. Last year, everybody knows about it. I know. Last year I was at VidCon and I, I talked to a bunch of uh, YouTube executives, and they said at YouTube they have a very exclusive meeting room that you need special permission to use called the Double Rainbow Room. <laughs> Look, me out here alone, out here alone on the wilderness has influenced YouTube. The double right? rainbow room. Stop it. <laughs> right? I love it. <laughs> Kevin right. Alaka did a big thing about me on TED, TED Talks. All oh, right. Yeah. yeah. Has anybody been up to, to any of you on this fire? No. 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 Okay, okay rolling. 
what, what have you seen here the last couple of days? Uh, okay, so um, on Father's Day around noon, I, I heard a siren and then I heard a, a bomber. And it was like, okay, I know what that is. There's a fire, right? So I started getting in that mode. And then I videotaped out there the fire just starting and going up. I have it all on time lapse. And I've just been filming all the helicopters and the planes. And um, yesterday I was talking to a, C a guy from CNN about uh, this I report. And um, this thing blew up. This mountain it looked like a volcano. It blew up from the other side. And, and that, like that's a video that everyone's paying attention to. must have scared the right hell out of you here, though. No, I, I don't have any fear. I, I never have any fear. I walk without fear. Why? Uh, How is that? Well, th what fear is pointless. I mean, I know if something's safe, I know if it's not safe. If it's not safe, then I just, you know, change. You're refusing to leave because this yeah. is your home. Right. This is, I mean, this is the place you love. Right. But also, I, there's no danger here. I don't, there's no danger to me. I know I have a four-wheel drive vehicle right there. If it comes down to it, I'll just jump in it with my dogs and I'll leave. Plus, I got a water uh, hot tub right over here. And I have a 2,500-gallon water tank. Yeah, is online, and I'm like, wow, it's like I can have four water hoses going at the same time. <laughs> you're, a, you're a brave man. I've seen no, this stuff burn. No, I know what I'm doing. It's that's not brave at all. It's just like, but this uh, is this is a place that you love. This is this mountain was made popular by your video. That's true. <laughs> yeah. What is it like to see this stuff going up and be threatened by fire? Uh, it, fire is a part of nature. I think it's beautiful, and I think it's exciting, and. Um, I don't. I don't see anything bad in it. You know, I just think it's a beautiful thing, and I'm not afraid of it. It's just like, it means something though, because at one point it looked like a volcano, and I was like, whoa, that's that, wow. These <laughs> the videos kind of, kind of getting some attention now, but yeah, that was that was intense. You what uh, is, you don't love this place. You need this place. What is it about uh, this I'm place? A what is it I, about this place for you? Um, my children are Yosemite Indians, and um, we have a thriving culture here, and so I feel real connected to the to this area. I came to live and work in Yosemite in 1985 when I was 22 years old, and um, bought this land in 1988 when I was 25, and have developed it myself. I turned it into a farm. I hacked it out of that wilderness out there, and uh, you know it's like, but I, it's for you. It's a it's a deep emotional connection. Why why risk your life? Why risk everything you have to stay here and watch what's happening? I'm not risking anything. I mean, I'm perfectly fine. I'm in no danger. I have never been in any danger. If I if I sense danger, I will react accordingly. If I think it's going to blow up here, if it's like there's 100 tall, foot tall frames, I'll drive away. I'll be fine. Did you consider driving yesterday? Oh, no, not at all. Too, too far away. Yeah, it's, I mean, if, okay, here's what, here's the thing. If, if it comes down that mountain and comes up my side, yeah. then what I'm going to do is I'm going to light the fire. I'm going to water right here. And if it's still coming, then I'll leave. You know what I mean? But if it's called backfire, I know fire science major, I was a firefighter for LA County Fire Department. You just, I know I'm, it's all planned, right? There's dead vegetation right there. I just light it, I water out here to protect my gardens and fruit trees, and it burns that way. When the fire comes this way, it's already gone. The fuel's gone. To lose this, so what would it mean to you? I can't lose it. I mean, the house might burn down, but uh, you know, I'll just come back, I'll put a tent, and I'll start back. The house is a piece of junk. <laughs> I mean, it's a 1977 mobile home. If it burned down, it's like it's not that big a loss. <laughs> but you have, I mean, this place is in your soul, yeah. isn't it? That's true. I, I'm, I feel like I'm the protector of this land. Yeah. And it's, it, it, it's a very powerful place, and now it's very famous <laughs> because of the Double Rainbow video. <laughs> <laughs> right, <laughs> right here. All that that rainbow was all the way across that guy. Kind of like that contrail. <laughs> right. Look. <laughs> you might want to stay on this one. Show, show me again where the, so, the rainbow so was. The rainbow looked like that contrail right there. It goes all went all the way from there to there. That's miles across. And you know what? And when I was here, I was like. That looks like a giant eyeball. And I was like, what could have an eye that big? I'm like, oh my God, God is looking at me. I had just written this email. I said like, I felt like I'm Noah. So I write this email, I send it, and my house fills with color. And I grab my Sony hand camera again, and I'm just holding it right here. And I walk that way, and, and when I get to where there's no trees, it feels like a giant hand pushes me to the ground. And I'm on my butt. And that's when I start like getting intense, right? I start crying because I've been touched by God. 
And all these things that are coming, these words that are coming out of me, it's just God speaking through me. Now, I here I just thought you were some crazy person. Yeah. But you this this really happened. You are you are double rainbow. I'm man. Noah. <laughs> Right? <laughs> I got my own farm. I got three trees. I have my own well. And by Noah, you mean what? Okay, Noah had an ark. Right? No, no, this is my ark. I'm on my land. I have my own water. I have alternative energy. I'm growing food to eat. If society crumbles, which I think it is, that's why I bought this land, I'm going to stay on this ark. <laughs> All right. You are double rainbow man, my friend. Thank you very much. You're welcome. So if you don't mind, we'll, uh, we'll get a little bit. Sure. Could you stay there for a second? Okay, I just I get want a little a bit of a video of you at your uh, command center. You so guys, how much video are you shooting? Um, Tracy, hours and hours. Could you come over here? All right, we got to go. Get okay. on the road, my friend. Yeah. We're going to be screwed. Good luck. Thank Very nice to meet you. Yeah, nice meeting you guys. If, if we come back or if we find anybody coming up here, we'll let them know the food. What do you What do you want? Just <laughs> Anything fresh. Bread. Yeah. Yeah, something like that. Anything. Just butter. Yeah. Anything's fine. Okay. Yeah, I'm starting to run a little bit low, and I don't want to leave because they won't let me come back. Well, it sounds like you're going to get it. It's going that way. It was coming this way for a little bit, coming up that mountain, but it's all heading that way now. All right. Watch you guys. Sorry about your